Yeah, and taxing Coca-Cola would just increase their production costs, leading them to lay off many employees. As you said, many Indian workers and families rely on Coca-Cola for a stable income, so solutions must be sensitive. Fuck! <laughs> yeah. Okay. This results in the welfare loss, the damage dealt to society as a result of exceeding the marginal cost. Fuck. Um, okay. No, 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 no. If like, it's not the No. This results in the welfare loss, the damage dealt to society as a result of exceeding the marginal social cost level. Pretty much the inefficiency as a re. Uh, sha, 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 fuck. Okay. Try again. <laughs> okay. Free life. Okay. The. the uh, uh, bye -bye. Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pompous Paper Puppies podcast. I'm Salvatore and this is Kiara. Hello. And today we're going to talk about market failure, when the allocation of goods and services is not efficient. With that in mind, have you ever drank Coca-Cola? Of course you have, but did you know that CSE has discovered it's quite... shit. <laughs> it's... Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Pompous Paper Puppies podcast. I'm Salvatore, and this is Chiara. Hello! And today we're going to talk about market failure, when the allocation of goods and services is not efficient. With that in mind, have you ever drank Coca-Cola? Of course you have, but did you, know that, did you know that CSE has discovered it's, and I quote, a cocktail of three to five different pesticides in every sample? That is a fun fact we found in an article by Earth Talk. The different article... That, the article is about our topic today, a prominent example of a failing market. Kara, could you um, inform us? Okay, so, last year in April, Fatco released that article that discussed the issue of Coca-Cola's contaminating production in India. The illegal abuse of local water reserves has triggered several droughts. It has triggered several droughts? No, several droughts compared con with this. Okay. Um, execution. Um, Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Pompous Paper Puppies podcast. I'm Salvatore, and this is Kiara. Hello! And today we're going to be talking about market failure, when the allocation of goods and services is not efficient. With that in mind, have you ever drank Coca-Cola? Of course you have, but did you know that the CSE has discovered it's, and I quote, a cocktail of three to five different pesticides in every sample? That is a fun fact we found in an article by Earth Talk. The article is about our topic today. A prominent example of a failing market. Chiara, could you um, inform us? Of course. So, last year in April, FATCO released that article to discuss the issues of Coca-Cola contaminating production in the factory. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Just okay. Try again. Try again. Okay. So, wait. Of course. So, last year in April, FATCO released that article to discuss the issue of Coca-Cola's contaminating production in India. The illegal abuse of local water reserves, combined with an ongoing drought, has forced civilians to walk up to five kilometers to get clean water supplied by the government. And to top it all off, Coca-Cola offers free fertilizer to local farmers, which is just waste sludge from the production. The civilians' protests led the Indian government to shut down one of the 58 factories Coca-Cola has in India. Basically, 